Apple's WWDC 2013 is off to a flying start, with iOS 7, iRadio and a new MacBook Air forming the top of this year's agenda. Here's a quick roundup from Apple's keynote address. iOS 7 has been revealed at long last, introducing a number of new and improved features as well as a bold new look for Apple. Users will now be able to multitask with all apps, while the notification bar will be accessible from the lock screen. The software will be coming to iPhone, iPod and iPad later this year. New music streaming service iTunes Radio is being built into the music app on iOS 7, iTunes and Apple TV. It will be a free service but users will have to put up with ads unless they opt for the paid for iTunes match. The music streaming service will be coming to the US first with other countries added later. An updated MacBook Air is also joining Apple's product lineup. The new device promises an all-day battery life and is built on the new Intel Haswell chip which has been designed with energy efficiency in mind. Apple lifted the lid on the brand new Mac Pro, giving its desktop computer the biggest overhaul since 2010. The new cylinder shaped model is just a fraction of the size of the previous system and is said to be 10 times faster too. It will come rocking Thunderbolt 2 and is capable of handling three 4K displays at once. The latest version of Apple's Mac OS has been announced as OS X Maverick and is set to bring a load of new features such as folder tagging, a redesigned calendar app as well as a new version of Safari with a cloud-based password keychain iBooks is coming to Mavericks 2, which will allow users to sync their libraries across devices. For all the latest news direct from WWDC 2013, be sure to stay tuned to techradar.com.